With multi-voice support, you can define conversational agents that switch voice. So here, I've got a simple language learning agent. It has a simple first message and a system prompt and is instructed to talk to me in English. However, when it's reading out Russian and Finnish words, I want it to use voices that sound good in those languages. So I've defined inside of multi-voice support that it has access to a Russian voice and a Finnish voice. These are voices available inside the platform. I've stated that the TTS should be done in this language so that it will sound higher quality. And I've stated which model family it should use. You can use any inside of Eleven Labs. You also need to give a description. This will teach the LLM when it should use this voice, when it should switch to it. And then we will take care of doing the text of speech and making sure it flows naturally. From there, once you've got that set up, you can just have a conversation. And at the right points in the conversation, the agent will use a different voice. Let's try it out. Hi, welcome to your lesson. Hey, so I'd really like to know how to say the number 11 in, in Russian. 11. Okay, that was cool. How would I say it in Finnish, however? 11. Can you explain to me why 11 means 11 in Russian? The Russian word for 11, 11 is formed by combining the word for one 11. with a suffix that indicates the teens. It's a fascinating glimpse into how numbers are constructed in the language. So that was an amazing experience. We just had a conversation with an English agent, but it was able to switch to Russian and Finnish voices whenever it needed it. And it really felt like I was talking to a native English speaker that also knew Russian and Finnish perfectly. Once I'm done with the conversation, I can go and look in our conversation history and I'll see that the different voices are tagged inside the transcript view. So I can see here that the agent spoke here and then the Russian voice was used here, the Finnish voice was used here. So that was a brief overview of what you can achieve with multi-voice. We've seen people do lots of different use cases for this. You can create voices that are slightly slower that the agent should use when it's talking to elderly people. You can also create different characters that a single conversational agent can act as. You can also create podcasts between different characters. So you're having a conversation with one agent, but at certain points it takes on a different person's voice and sounds like you're having a, a podcast interview with multiple people. We think multi-voice is a really neat feature. I'll make a couple of videos around those other use cases I mentioned and also show you how it integrates into our testing framework. I look forward to seeing you in those videos.